welcome. Let's have a look at our split orders to multiple addresses plugin. This plugin works hand in hand with our other plugin called Ship to Multiple Addresses, and together they solve a very big problem that a lot of you may have. So, what's the problem? Well, here it is. Your shoppers want to be able to put any number of items in their cart and choose to have some of those items shipped to different addresses. Well, that's easy when you're using our Ship to Multiple Addresses plugin because that's what it's designed to let your shoppers do. But when the order comes into your store, it's one single order as usual, so your shipping label solutions can't see the additional addresses and which items are supposed to be shipped to those addresses, so it can't print the labels for each address. Here's the solution. This plugin, Split Orders with Multiple Addresses, does exactly what the name says. When a new order comes in that has multiple shipping address chosen by the shopper, the plugin automatically splits the order into new orders, where you get one new order per address that the shopper chose at checkout. And the corresponding items for each address are put into the new order. So boom, the problem's solved. Now your shipping label solutions work as expected because they can read the correct shipping address along with the order items for each order and print shipping labels correctly. So this means basically if you're using stamps.com or maybe Shipworks or ShipStation or Shippo, ShipperHQ, Shipping Easy, or any of the other many shipping solutions out there to generate your labels, or maybe you're even using a plugin that generates shipping labels for you, well, all of those should work correctly now. So let's do a quick walkthrough so that you can see how this thing works and get a visual idea and a better understanding. So here on the screen, we have a demo store with some demo products. And I'm just going to put this beanie and this belt into the cart. So I have two items in the cart. And we'll take a look at the cart real quick. Yep, there they are and we'll just proceed to checkout and here on the checkout page you can see at the top there's a banner added by our ship to multiple addresses plugin so the shopper can choose to ship items to different addresses so we'll click that and you can see i have a series of addresses already configured here at the top and if i scroll down i see my order items here and i can choose different addresses for different items so this one is the beanie is set to ship to dallas texas and so is the belt by default but i'm going to click and choose a different address let's choose uh the chicago illinois address okay so we got the beanie going to dallas we got the belt going to chicago and i'm just going to click save selections and here you see the order review on the right side of the screen is updating and after it updates, now I see two sets of shipping options, one for Dallas and one for Chicago. So just to clarify my example, I'm going to choose ground, UPS ground for Dallas, and I'm going to choose UPS second day air for Chicago. And the totals update, etc. And again, all of that functionality you just saw is part of our ship to multiple addresses plugin. But here's where the split orders to multiple addresses comes in to play. So when I place the order as the shopper, I'm going to be redirected to a order confirmation page in just a second. And here we are. And so I can see, thank you, your orders have been received. And I see here at the top, order number 92923. And we have a shipping address right here, whoops, of Dallas. And the beanie is going to Dallas via UPS ground and if I scroll down further I have a second order 92924 and this one's going to Chicago and this is the belt going via second day air so the shoppers order got split into two because there were two different addresses and now when your shipping label generator software whatever it is you're using needs to read the shipping address out of an order and which items are going there so it can calculate the shipping rate uh, for the label, the cost, it'll work correctly. So let's take a look at the My Account page for the shopper here. So if we go to Orders, we see here we have these two new orders as expected. And of course, if I view it, I see all the order details as expected. 
and same for the other order if I go to this one I can see the order details ground shipping shipping address Dallas etc so then in the admin area you as the site admin when you come and look at your WooCommerce orders here you're going to see these two new orders right here as expected and when you look at one here we have order number 92923 it's going to Dallas as you can see right there and you scroll down and we have the beanie UPS ground shipping and so there we go so your uh, shipping label solutions whatever it is you're using should be able to grab the, all the relevant data the shipping address and the items and correctly print the labels and that is the big problem that this plugin solves for you so just to review here are the benefits you get easier order management because the software splits new orders based on shipping address where you get one order per shipping address you get easier order status updates because there are individual orders and you can update the status individually as you process it. For example, we just placed a new order that wound up being two orders because it was split. And so maybe you're going to ship one right away and the other one's going to be shipped in three days from now. Um, well, you can update one status and then update the other one later. And also, you can add tracking numbers in there and that's where the better customer support comes in because you have individual orders you can provide tracking numbers to the customer for each individual order and they know what's going on with their shipment and are able to track it so that's what this plugin does uh, we hope you find it useful and keep in mind this only works with our ship to multiple addresses plugin from Ignite Woo. It does not work with anyone else's multiple address plugin. So there you go. Thanks for watching.